Hi, I'm Anna and this is my kitchen. When Ralph and I built our home, I had the fun opportunity to be able to design my kitchen the way I wanted it. In this video, I'm gonna show you some of our favorite features. We had a pot filler installed over the stove. What I really like about it is it fills up our pots with water really quickly. Also our kettles and whatever else we need with water. I was on the fence about having an ice and water dispenser. I wanted a clean, sleek look, but I'm glad I went with it. It's so convenient to have filtered water and ice on demand. One aspect that I didn't really realize how helpful it would be is when we have friends and family come over, they can just help themselves. This goes along with the fridge. Having clear glass for plates, mugs, and especially glassware is handy when friends and family come over. Our home is a help yourself kind of place. So they can see what they need, they can grab it and help themselves. Anna and I, we don't like keeping our appliances out on the countertops, but for our coffee makers, we tend to use them on a daily basis. And our solution was to create a coffee station, which was intentional and by design, which we have right here. Now we did focus on this in a previous video, which will have a link right up here. My kitchen countertops are granite and I find granite to be so durable. In the house, I have both granite and quartz and I prefer the granite. I find that the quartz scuffs if I drag anything across it, whereas the granite just takes it and well, where's my granite? I opted for these ovens instead of wall double ovens because well, they look cool. And besides that, I like the idea of having a smaller oven for when I'm cooking for just me and Ralph. I found that it heats faster and I don't like the idea of heating up an entire large oven for something small for just me and Ralph. Anna and I placed our recycle and our garbage in a location that we considered would be convenient, easily accessible and also hidden out of the way. So we placed it inside the island in a drawer. We put in the largest island we could fit into this kitchen. I like having just a big open workspace. I didn't even put a sink in here. When we're entertaining, this is a great space to lay out drinks and apps or even a full buffet. Even though the kitchen does have a good amount of storage, there's no such thing as too much storage. So the island has cabinets on both sides. This side is for items that we use every day all the time. The side that you sit at, that's where we store items that we use occasionally, but still like to have handy, like roasting pans. This is my prep space, so an outlet is most convenient. If I'm making smoothies or using the food processor, it's easier on the island, which is just a big open space. So I need an outlet. Just make sure the color coordinates with your cabinets. We had a soap dispenser installed, and then later we attached that to an entire jug of soap. And you can check out how that's done in our home hacks video. It's nice to have a little extra room around the sink for soap and whatever else I feel like storing there but we didn't want to bump this part out. So our solution was to drop the window and then have the counter meet up with it flush. We added extra space between the stove and the island. You know when you're entertaining, everybody congregates in the kitchen and this helps it feel less crowded. Also, when more than one person's cooking in here, no one's tripping over each other. I picked this microwave oven because I thought it was really cool. It opens like a drawer, and this makes it easier to place items inside of it, especially since it is installed below counter height. This is a must for me. Soft clothes, doors and drawers. Nothing slams and the doors and drawers open and close so smoothly. A must for me is having a smart assistant like a Google Nest Hub near the kitchen. It helps with setting timers, turning on lights when your hands are dirty, looking up recipes, doing conversions for measurements, or just playing some music when you're cooking. My absolute favorite feature of the kitchen is that the inside of my fridge is black. And just because that's cool. And that's our kitchen. For anyone designing a new kitchen right now, like you, Jen, I hope this was an inspiration. And to help our channel grow, please remember to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of our future videos.
We'll see you soon. Bye bye. When Ralph and I built this house, I had the great. Great? Did I ever say great? No. No. <laughs> so I just said. <laughs> great! Okay. Pew, 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 pew. <laughs> okay, no laughing back there. Recording with Ralph. So hard. Oh, like when you do it by yourself, you don't do like 22 takes, right? I know, but I don't make myself laugh. Okay. Uh. Hi. Hi, I'm doing that again. I only do that when... Uh.